So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. The teams then, Roma against Inter. This is Peter Drury, and next to me, providing insights, will be Jim Beglin. Cheers, Peter. It's a privilege to be here. It really is. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Maicon. He does what most Brazilian fullbacks do, raiding the flanks with every opportunity, and there are no half measures with Maicon when they've scored! And some of the best managers i played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Swift, incisive, deadly, all done in a matter of seconds. Well, talking about being hit on the break, the ball was in their net before they could even organise their defence. It was fast and furious and all but unstoppable. Roma didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Shakiri looking for options. Just the goalkeeper to beat. He scores! And with the match still in its infancy, they are easing away. I think he just thought about trying his look from further out there, but why bother when you can worm your way through a defence like that? It's it's terrific play to, to get through and score. Into Milan, get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Tries a through ball, out towards the flank. All the balls come loose! Given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. I just think there was too much ball watching. Uh, nobody's really looking to see who's drifting into good striking positions, and it's a bad one to give away, it really is. Roma get themselves back into contention. I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Roma have enjoyed a fine start to the season, six points out of six. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Jose Holobas floats one over. Well, that's where he wants it. Can he find a finish now? And he's there to hoof it away. Hernanes. Shakiri set up one goal so far. Shakiri! And in it goes. And with that goal comes comfort. Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Inter Milan take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Yeah, they may well be two up now, but the beauty of this game is that it can all change in a flash. And it's Maicon. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Danger averted for now. Icardi. Puts his foot on the gas. Keeper's got good distance on that. Right. 
Engelan. There's a long pass towards the front. Cuts it out. Into Milan. They're in control here on the brink of half time. De Rossi created that super goal to produce a lead in their last game. Pjanic. Michael. And it's Iturbe. Pjanic. Aim forward. Hoists it high. Nangalan. Pjanic. Lajic. Those scoring skills have already been evident. Jovino. Pjanic plays a clever pass. And the first 45 minutes are up. Into Milan, head in for half time with a 3 1 lead. That gets things going for the second half. Palacio. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And it's Hernanes. Looking to force his way through. And that would have been some goal. Oh, that was a great run right through the centre as well. He did ever so well to retain possession too. As for the shot, wasn't the worst, but not up to scratch. It so nearly came off for him. He's just a nightmare for any defence. His movement, his pace, his anticipation, it's on another level. It's so hard for any defence to contain that. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? A chance! Chance again? No. Well, I wonder if their profligacy will rebound on them somehow. You know, they're very much on the up here, and yet they can convert a string of very decent opportunities. There he is, making his presence felt. Well, there's no doubt that the whole team revolves around him now. He leads by example, and he's become the main pivot. Kraken player. Guarín. Hernández. De Rossi. Pulls off an exemplary piece of defending. Michael. Pjanic plays it long. Here it comes. Well, that's not the cross he had in mind. Oh, good interception. And it's Shakiri. Has a look and has a go. And that wasn't far away. Oh, it was almost a beautifully placed shot. He's so unlucky not to see that go in. He's putting on a show here, I think. Well, he's certainly a player I'd be more than happy to watch. Tactically, he's almost impossible to stop. Good idea, just poorly executed. Now it's in Turbe. Now the pass. Now here's the through ball. In Turbe. Forward. What does he try from here? Campagnaro pumps it forwards. Roma not lucky. They have escaped lightly. Michael. Pjanic. Lajic. Hit long and direct. And the defence can get it clear. Through. Gonna go down too well with his teammates. Oh, checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Yeah, it's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty late. Pjanic. Michael. Pjanic. Turbe. 
Ziyech. Michael. Tries lifting it over. Oh, and look who's there doing the defending. Jovino. Lajic passes it through. Lovely feet. Pjanic. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Well positioned to make that interception. Worry. Hernanes. It's Icardi. De Rossi demonstrates his quality. The referee's awarded a free kick. <laughs> Shot a goal! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, the last line of defence came to the rescue when the line's in... And that is that. Inter Milan always looked the more driven side, probably the better side. Nobody is arguing about the results. After all of that, Jim, what are you thinking?